reading shiftlings file here and in this guide we're gonna be talking about the builds function in the hut builds was given to us in neo 2 that wasn't present in neo 1 and it allows you to save your whole stats and skills configuration to load it whenever you need to swap to something else or you just want to experiment and don't want to risk losing all the settings you had applied on your character it's very different from saving armor sets in a way that it drastically alters your character and takes him back to the way you had set him or her up initially and because some people seem to struggle with it we're gonna go in depth and we're gonna explain everything about it so first and foremost we go to starting point and we go to hut now we go to builds on the top of the screen you can see my first save build genma that was my initial build for the purposes of this video we'll be going between my genma and twin peaks build both of which you can find in the description below so here's genma and here's twin peaks i'm running twin peaks at the moment so these two builds are builds i have saved in the past how do we do that we'll go to an empty slot and we do not see anything we do not know what we will be saving so we need to bring it in front of us to evaluate it so we press r3 that's the right stick and this is my currently running set so now we know what we are saving and we want to save it is what we're running right now we press r3 again we click x and we save it now by clicking x again we can do certain things we can restore it save something on top of it change its name see the details of items and the bonus taken from any set or we can raise it okay naming your builds will help you find the one you want easier and raising it of course will empty up the slot now let's say that i'm running this 99 constitution 40 heart 26 courage 10 stamina 99 strength 12 skill 26 dexterity and 30 magic build called twin peaks but we want to do something different or we're gonna go back and try something a little bit more optimal in a build we were running in the past we press x and restore and the game says use a book of reincarnation to restore this build if we click yes it will use a book of reincarnation and it will set up everything the way we had it stats Guardian Spirits, course, our equipment, our Jutsu. Of course, it will not temper our equipment. We'll just have the item saved, granted it's available. It will not distort, restore equipment that we have destroyed or course that we have deleted, perform resting rights on or soul fused. Only things that are currently available will be restored. The rest will you have to be placed again. So we use this and we'll go back to my wonderful waifu here and as you can see it's 40 constitution, 40 heart, 28 courage, 20 stamina, 90 strength, 10 skill, 15 dexterity, 99 magic. My old Genma build with my old armor and my switch glaive and my great Kanemitsu and so on and so forth. Okay, when it comes to skills you get these exclamation marks, those are the arts of combat. Okay. There's one here as well. And the skills here are how you had them when you saved that build. Okay. So everything is reverted back to when you saved that build. Any points that haven't been used since you saved that build will also be available to be distributed so if you had 98 points in shifting and now you have accumulated a total of a hundred the two remaining points are available in shifting the same goes for your titles if you had 98 title points distributed the two remaining points here and here one in each will be available to distribute now skill customization 
it reverts everything back to how you had them but if you press l3 the left stick everything you have you have saved like my singular spear here for tosa is the way you saved it you do not lose any data by using the builds function ever okay nothing is reconfigured when it comes to your saved items to your saved uh, customizations it just takes every piece brings it back to the front and recreate your character to the best and most faithful result possible no tempering will be done any cores that don't exist exist will have to be replaced and everything you can save in lists such as this will be found in the list again of course the book of reincarnation guys is used it's done but you do not have to respect everything by hand eliminating any chance of you making a mistake and wasting a lot of time for pretty much nothing so it's not as daunting just to go back and try different things hope this clears it up as always i'm filed i'm covering everything in neo2 so sub like and share if you find this enjoyable and useful and until next time be well stay frosty and always strive for perfection cheers <laughs>